Oh, we got a, a bifurcated lead here. Let me start with this one. The bidding blitz for Disney's newly acquired regional sports networks attracting a who's who of sports and media titans. This in a totally unrelated story. Michael Avenatti, that attorney, has been arrested on charges of extortion. Who's that guy? To deal with both. Charlie Gasparino. Thank you. I, I, First, the RSN story. Yeah, we just uh, put a fine point on this because, you know, we've been covering this. This is the outgrowth of the Disney deal buying, $71 billion deal buying Fox's entertainment assets. They also got all these regional sports networks. These are networks that are sold through cable providers, mm -hmm. 21 of them around the country. They feature all sorts of different programming. They have to unload that because they own ESPN. According to the Justice Department, this bidding's been going on since November. We're going to have a full write up on it in foxbusiness.com. And here's the interesting thing, Liz, it is finally coming to an end. Here's what we, we have from sources close to the deal, that April 15th has been described as the final drop-dead date for bids. If you want to bid it, bid on this thing, it's final, it's Did binding. Did we finally get new graphics for yeah, this story? I mean, you know, we're going to have the best graphics today. By the end, over. and the story's <laughs> over. <laughs> right? But no, we got until April 15th, so we got some more stories to go. <laughs> and maybe there's some more bidders. But that's it. It's Come on, over Ohio. on a April 15th. And here's what we know. So far, there are four bidders. It's ML Major League Baseball, Sinclair Broadcasting, Liberty Media, and Hip Hop Star, Ice Cube's Big Three Basketball League, are the, are the, are the bidders on this thing. There may be more. Um, there was a lot of talk about Amazon being interested in all the uh, RSNs. So far, they've only been interested in one of them. It's the Yankees RSN, the, Ye the, the Yes Entertain Entertainment Network, Yankees Entertainment Network. Uh, that deal was closed. It's un People doubt they're going to get into these. So just so you know, mm -hmm. that doesn't mean they won't, but I'm just telling you, they doubt it. So this thing is coming to an end, a six-month uh, a six-month deal. Uh, they initially thought they were going to get twenty billion for the, for all these. They're getting far less. And you know, the one the reason for this is not that they're not good teams. It's called cord cutting, and it's affecting yeah. every business broadcasting business. We've got know. Apple's announcement, and, this now. and there it is. And so this thing is going to go for far left. If you add the Yankees in with this, if they get about ten for that, they're not. That far below 20 billion, but they're below it. It's, it's something like 13 billion. Anyway, go We've ahead. We've got a major arrest. I know, Avenatti. That started to unfold this afternoon. That Michael Avenatti, of course, you may remember Stormy Daniels' attorney, former attorney. Who could forget attorney, Stormy Daniels? He's been charged with extortion. Right. A remember, Stormy case. Daniels had sex with Trump, allegedly, right? Allegedly, That's yeah. Is. And uh, this was a very contentious right. Donald and, Trump, and, Michael and Avenatti. And they paid him this off. A very, <laughs> it's a great day for Donald Trump today. Not yeah. only does he get the Mueller. Uh, okay, so situation, here's what he did. Uh, uh, unpack this. His a nemesis bit. has been arrested. Right. Okay. So he goes to Nike. He says, "I have some dirt on you guys." Avenatti. Uh, yeah. Invo Avenatti involving the uh, the sports sponsorship. NCAA uh, right. recruiting and issues, and he says, "Yeah." And pay me X, or I disclose it. And pay I'm, me X to do the internal investigation, right. or I will disclose. And X was and, twenty million. And, and I'll disclose it around the time of your earnings, so it'll have maximum damage. Uh, sounds like extortion to me, but let me ask you this. Just play devil's advocate here, because I'm, this stuff happens more than you think. The, the lines are gray. People go right up to them. He's obviously been charged, so the U.S. Attorney for the Southern District, mm -hmm. which is a major, it's the, it's the sort of, you know, the cream of the crop in terms of prosecutors. Um, so they, they feel he did something wrong, and they're pretty independent. Uh, people are going to say this is a Donald Trump attack. I, no, the U.S. Attorney for the Southern District, they, he may he may appoint the U.S. Attorney for the Southern District because it's a it's a presidential appointment. But this is a very 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 independent office. Yeah. Always has been. Yeah, and but he let fired Preet, and right. it was a very independent right. office. It, it is. It is what it is. So, but let me ask you this: What's the difference between this and the Bezos thing, where David Pecker went to Bezos and said, "If you don't say something really nice about us, us meaning the National Enquirer." Mm -hmm. Because we have your, we've been doing all the reporting on your uh, on your affair with this with your with your girlfriend, and we're going to release uh, pictures of your of, of your private parts. Essentially, what it was. What's the difference between that and they, they, and he hasn't been charged? The only difference is photos, money. I say they're both extortion. Yeah, I've heard lawyers. Just so you know, that say both are. Well, we'll see what they say about Avenatti, but both are contracts. If, legally comma, bind, then equals legally, extortion. No, legally binding contracts. Let's enter into a deal. You'll benefit, I benefit, and no one loses. So, <sighs> I'm telling you, I, I've I, heard I, lawyers I, argue that. Okay. I was on, I'm not saying it's true. I mean, you know, listen, I don't extort anybody.